Yesterday, March 2nd, 2024, was a really horrible day. Like, it was a black, black Saturday when it comes to Nigeria entertainment industry. And firstly, I want to send salutation and uh, blessings and mercy upon those who lost their life yesterday. Uh, be it the superstars that we know and uh, some of the superstars that we do not know and also our family, our friends, and also other Nigerians. Everybody around the world who lost their life yesterday, my blessings and salutation are currently with them. So uh, we know exactly what is happening currently in Nigeria. A legendary uh, Nollywood superstar, Mr. Ibu, died at the age of 62 years. Can you imagine, guys? 62 years, still very, very young still very 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 young you know he has been battling in hospital for months now his leg was amputated twice so what happened according to weaknesses well this video i'm going to show i'm going to we're going we are going to merely discuss some of the celebrities that lost their life yesterday about four of them we have a king ensures uh, mother who lost her life yesterday again we have Mr. Ibu and also a very popular Yoruba uh, entertainer, C.C. Kodri, who lost his life yesterday. And also a, a former Super Falcon uh, player who also lost her life yesterday. You know, crazy stuff, crazy stuff. And also, so also many other Nigerians as well. This is also my salutation, but let us focus on people that we really know. So, like I said, Mr. Ibu was uh, battling... Uh, hospital uh, battling for his health in hospital for the past few months now his leg was amputated twice and he was still having some complications and you know because of uh, the donations from the family uh, from fans the family has uh, somehow kind of like scattered if i may use that word with a mr ibu adopted daughter going her separate ways and also uh his senior uh, kids also not uh, really really that involved but it was just mr Ibu and his wife and uh, the wife uh, the, the kids that were like fully involved so according to very dark man and the people who reached out to very dark man they said they never really had the news the people close to mr Ibu, the family never really had the news that mr Ibu was dead that mr Ibu went to underwent a surgery without informing anybody without informing anybody that uh, they had, he, was, he has passed through the internet. You know, it's crazy just to tell you how the family is currently battling. And be rest assured, be rest assured that in the next few, be rest assured in the next few days, you'll be hearing about property, properties, money, money, properties who took this who took that money 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 all those kind of stuff be rest assured you will be hearing about that that is something inevitable even when the guy was alive they're already battling for properties in fact several have come up to say nobody should donate to mr Ebu again because this family are taking us for a cruise so guys and now he has passed on i hope they can rest now about the burial rites, the funeral, there is no information about that yet. You might see people posting about it, but there is no information about that yet. He's a Christian, of course, they are going to deposit his body. Firstly, according to the Christian rites, in the mortuary first, before preparation and every other rite will follow. So, Mr. Abel really made our life really bearable for us while we were growing up in school, in body school, uh, me as at that time. I really, really love his, uh, his movies. He will never, never be forgotten in our heart. We wish him well. We, I pray for him. I, 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 you know, he's gone, man. He's gone, and the rest trouble is for the family alone. Let, let them now face the trouble. Let them now uh, go home and fight for properties. <laughs> it's crazy. That is just the life of man. After working so much, and uh, end up uh, passing, and then your family will be out there fighting over your properties. It's quite unfortunate. It's quite unfortunate. 
So that being said, let's talk about CC Cordery. Honestly, I don't really know much about CC Cordery, but I've seen him a few times um, before. I never knew it was that really, really important and popular when it comes to the Yoruba entertainment industry. Because yesterday I was kind of like carried away and mesmerized with the number of people who came to mourn his passing. He was a really, really young man. He was a really, really young man. There was a video that shows him complaining about his health in the hospital and people not taking uh, serious, taking him serious about his health. And now he passed on. You know, he was a really, 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 really young man. You know, because of uh, the Muslim right, because Sisi uh, Kodru, a uh, Muslim, because of the Muslim right, it was immediately, immediately buried yesterday without wasting much time because of Muslim rights. So I love that about uh, Muslims. Uh, if someone passed on and is confirmed that he has passed on, let him rest. Let him rest. He can rest and uh, whoever wants to fight over something can decide to fight, but let the person rest. You can decide to fight yourself, but let the person rest. So there have been some really side talk, so misstatement and everything coming from the family, how he passed on and everything. But I do not know much. But what I know is that the guy was quite loved by so many people. Because many people, many celebrities came to pay their last respect. And everywhere was blocked just to tell you how the guy was really, really loved. He was a really young man. There was no call for him passing that young. Well, only God knows the reason why. Uh, I cannot question God, and uh, his family can definitely not question God. But um, may so continue to rest in peace. And I, I, I hope he, he finds a peace of wherever he is. And also, guys, uh, moving past C.C. Codri, let's talk about Kate Enshaw. Kate Enshaw, mother, passed on yesterday again. And according to uh, AG, Actor Guard Nigeria, AG President, he was the one that uh, issued out the statement. He said, sad day for Actor Guard of Nigeria. Kate Enshaw lost her mom earlier today and Mr. Ibu suffered cardiac arrest. According to his manager, for 24 years, Mr. Don uh, Singo, Wonzo are announced with deep sense of grief that Mr. Abel didn't make it. May so rest in peace. He was the one that actually really, really confirmed it. After yesterday, the team was going around. He actually confirmed it that Mr. Abel has passed. He was the one that confirmed it. Then he also confirmed that Kate Enshaw's mother all also passed yesterday again. And Kate Enshaw is currently mourning a mom. So can okay, ensure we not have that time? Of course, it's going to send some condolences to Mr. Ibu, that I'm sure, but to mom, uh, Mr. Ibu. But we already know the 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 role Kate Ensure played as at that time when it comes to Mr. Ibu's health. How Mr. Ibu's wife called out Kate Ensure and the trouble around it, Kate Ensure had to come out to clear the air, to clear herself. Well, you know. Some really, really crazy stuff there happened to Mr. Abel because of money. All because of money. All because of money. That is why up to now I keep saying, eh, let them, let us see how they are going to eat the money now. Most definitely, in the next few hours, you will be hearing them fighting about social property, social property, property here, property there, property here and here, you know, fighting for everyone, fighting to take. Is all I share from uh, fans donations from the from the things the man left behind. You know, it's crazy, but that's just how life is. That's just how life is. And uh, to end this video, it's quite unfortunate for Super Falcom former goalkeeper uh, Benemi Aluko Ola Sini, who passed away after battling with cancer. Yesterday was a really crazy day. Oh. Yesterday was a really crazy day. May God save God our life. May God. Ah. Yesterday was a really crazy day, guys. Yesterday was a really crazy day. March, you have been really crazy to us. Oh. What is happening? 
Let me say a prayer. March will not match us in Jesus' name. March will not match us in the name of Allah. Hmm? March will not match us. March will not match us. March will not match us. And I hear you say amen. So uh, the super, the former Super Falcon uh, as goalkeeper, uh, the Nigeria F uh, Football Federation, FFF, has announced the passing of the Super Falcon as goalkeeper. According to them, they said, we are sad to hear of the passing of our former uh, Super Ego, Super Falcon goalkeeper, Bindemi, after an eight-year battle with cancer, our thoughts and prayers are with the family. May our gentle soul rest in peace. Amen. So guys, uh, kindly leave your prayers and salutations. These are the people who lost their life yesterday. May their soul continue to rest in paradise. May their soul continue to rest in peace. And uh, other people as well who lost their life that we do not know. Uh, who are just uh, normal, ordinary Nigerians and every other person yesterday, may their soul rest in peace. Amen.